What's up, Pacers Issue? We're back today with another video. Keep pounding. Today's topic is OJ Howard for the Tampa Bay Buccaneers, and should we trade for him? Hit that like button, hit that sub button, hit that bell so you don't miss any new content, and select all. Leave a comment down below if you feel so inclined. Let's get into it. Now, there was an article on, uh, I'm trying to find it, uh, Panthers Wire. That was suggesting that we trade for uh, Tampa Bay Buccaneers tight end O.J. Howard. Uh, and their argument was that if Tom Brady doesn't feel comfortable throwing to him, then uh, he could be up for a trade here soon. Uh, and they're suggesting that we give up a late round day three pick for him. Um, so let's do a little research on his numbers here. His career totals are 94 receptions for 1,456 yards, 15.5 average, 75 is his longest pass, uh, and 12 career touchdowns. Now I'll say this, he's consistent. His average is, uh, 13.5 last year but in the 16 range for the last two years 17 and 18 before that um he's consistently getting over 400 total yards receptions his best year was 34 receptions for 565 yards in 2018 and five touchdowns but uh just a little bit of info about him. He's 6'6", uh, 242 pounds, from uh, Alabama. And he was drafted in the first round of the 2017 NFL first NFL draft. Um, other than that, I don't know that much about him. But I think that when you look at our depth chart at tight end, we already picked up a tight end uh, from the Browns, formerly from the Browns. Uh, we've got Ian Thomas, and I don't remember the third guy that we have, but I think that would put uh, Ian Thomas's job in jeopardy if we do decide to trade for O.J. Howard. Uh, and I'm not sure how I feel about that at this current time. I would have to see O.J. Howard uh, clips and see how he handles catching the ball, you know, route running, uh, speed, agility, stuff like that. You know, there's a lot of stuff that you have to take into account when you're looking at uh, tight ends. Uh how does he block is a big one because a lot of the RPO spread RPO that we plan on running deals with blocking. Um, and it deals with route running and catching. So what I'm going to need to see on him is some video clips to see what we're dealing with, uh, highlights. So, I'll be taking a look at that, and I'll let you guys know what I find um, before I make the next video. So, there you go. That's OJ Howard. Um, and there's also no guarantee that, that the Bucks will trade him and that Tom won't be comfortable with him, you know, in uh, Tampa Bay as he's re rebuilding and revisiting his roster that he wants down there. So they still have a lot of tools in Tampa Bay to work with, even if they do get rid of OJ. So we'll see what happens. We'll just have to play it by ear, but uh, according to the Panthers wire, it could be soon if they decide to, to put him on the market. So, that's the latest news. 
keep tuned to this channel for the latest news on Panthers. And uh, hit that like button, hit that sub button, hit that bell so you don't miss any new content. Select all and leave a comment. And I will see you guys next time. Let me know what you think of this. And keep pounding.